we're going to try for another toy hunt today. We're going to hit some weird places. First, we're going to go to Hobby Lobby. All right, so we're in the model aisle, and as you can see, all the box models are 40% off. So if you like Star Wars, you get Star Wars. But what they also sell are the Flame Toys Fear Eye model kits. I already have all these. They have Gundams. They have those. Basically, if it's in a box, uh, it counts as a model kit. It's 40% off. And that includes all of this stuff. So if you have a Hobby Lobby, I highly suggest checking it out for the model kits. Let's see. Oh, oh, I was looking for one of these. Tempted to buy one of these and modify it. Because they've also got a trailer. But I don't think it's the same scale. I don't know models to know the scales. Then... All the metal model kits, which does include and the guitar is pretty cool. So, yeah, this is why when I go on toy hunts, I also go to Hobby Lobby. You at Target. All right, and next we are going to go to the Target that's a couple buildings down and see what we can find there. All right, let's see what we can find today. There's this. Watching the show, I'm tempted to get these. If they had uh, the other figure from the show, I would tempted to get those. But that Thrash guy is pretty cool looking. Nothing really over here. Let's check another aisle. Here's the Target Gundam section, which is pretty cool. I don't think I have Perfect Strike Freedom, but it's hard to guess the prices on these two. They're listed, but you never know. Here's the Marvel Legends section. Yep, I'm gonna get Rogue. More Eternals that no one's ever gonna buy. Vulture. Very small section for them though. All right, Transformers section. Yeah, they have the World's Collide pack. Galvatrons. Oh. Dinobot Sludge. And Clobber. I might get Sludge. I might not. I might hold off and not buy every friggin' Dinobot that I can find. The McFarland. Batman DC Universe figures. Got our He-Man. Oh, we got some more Ghostbuster stuff. Nothing I'm looking for. It's all He-Man, Moss Man, Evil Lynn. Space Jam figures that need to go away. That's about it for this section. Looking at the little blind pack area. We got these, so we're gonna grab a couple of these. They got those weird Mobius rings. Frozen stuff. Not much though. And here's the NECA section. Some Raven spawn. Jason, Halloween, Predator. Puppet Master, that's, ah, oops. 
I didn't mean to do that. That's pretty cool. Unfortunately, I was hoping I would find some of those uh, Princess Bride figures, but they don't have them. Van Helsing, the Reptile. I don't know what these are. Weird. Cool. Beetlejuice. Always with the Funko Pops. Dune figures, I'm sure, are going to be on clearance everywhere soon. Weird printed Ninja Turtles. Not a fantastic selection. All right, we're about done. Well, we were wandering around and I happened to find this end cap, which is eternal stuff, but nice little selection, but that caught my eye. Not only. Interesting. Okay, now for a rather odd place to go during a toy hunt, we are going into BJ's. And I'll show you why. Okay, so here's why I came into BJ's, um, among some other things. Some little kid adventure sets, a Robo Raptor, if anybody remembers those, Lego City sets, some Smithsonian stuff, some arcade one up Pac Man's, but those little tiny ones for $170 is not worth it. More Marvel stuff. Light brights and Go Glam nail stampers. Disney Dorables. Squishy Littles. Giant Barbie dolls. Some nice Care Bear two packs. Nerf guns. Well, knockoff Nerf guns. Some more little kid stuff and some train sets. Some star bellies. So, there's nothing here now, but sometimes you'll find some things that are kind of worth it. If you can catch it at, on time, and sometimes things that are going to make you some money during the holiday season, you'll find here. So that's it for BJ's. Well, that's it for the weekend and the toy hunts. Picked up a couple of things. I grabbed that Rogue. I grabbed another Gundam model. Now the weekend is over, and it's time to get back to it. If you like these videos, give me a like, give me a subscribe. It's been a long weekend. I'm pretty tired. Hopefully I'll get my printers back up here soon. Have a good night.